Let's create a video message using my AI video to create our very first AI twin. There's two different ways you can get there. The first is to go to the home page and under this video messaging section, you'll see this button that says get started. You can click here or you can go over to the navigation on the left hand side and you'll see this button with the play sign, create a video message. Now you land on the my AI video home screen. This is where all of your videos will live once you create additional videos. If this is your first time ever creating a video message, this is what it will look like. You're going to hit get started if this is the first time or you can hit create new. Let's get started. The first thing that we need to do is upload an image of ourselves. It's very important that we find the right image to get the best results. You can see here's an image that's an example of something that will give you a very good result. It's because it's clear, it's front facing, so you can clearly see your face. You make sure that your shoulders and upper body are visible, and you wanna avoid anything covering or blocking your face. Now let's look at some options. I've already selected a few images in my library for us to look at. I'm gonna hit select. I'm going to go to my images. If you are going to upload your image, you're going to hit upload. But since I have mine already in my images, I'm going to go over here. Now under my images, I show you a few different images. So this image would not work well because the face is tilted. You can see a lot of teeth. These are very expressive. So these three images would not be ideal. This image as well, you see you have sunglasses, the mouth is open, you can see the teeth. The angle of the photo is going to confuse the AI and maybe result in some strange results. So we wanna go with an image like this in terms of the face, and it would even be better if we had a little bit more of the shoulders. So let's upload the perfect picture. Here I've uploaded an image where you can clearly see the shoulders, there's a neutral face, and the person is looking straight to camera. So this is the image that would work best. I'm gonna hit select, and then I'm going to hit add. Now you can see my image has been successfully uploaded to my library, and you can see the preview here. Now down here, you're gonna select the orientation of your video. Do you want it to be a horizontal video? This image is horizontal, but we may want it to be a vertical video. Let's say we wanna share it later on social media as a reel, we may want it to be vertical. So let's select vertical for this video. Next, we need to upload a sample of our speaking. To do this, we only need 10 to 12 seconds of audio or video from a file of a speaking. The best way to do this is to record it in a quiet environment where there's very little background noise. You wanna speak naturally and steady and avoid long pauses or very emphasized expressions. Over here, we're gonna title our voice sample because we may have different voices that we're gonna be uploading. And down here you can see an example of all the different file formats that are accepted, including MP3 and MP4. My favorite way to do this is to use a voice note on my iPhone, and I'm going to record the voice note of my voice, and then I'm going to send it to my computer and upload it here. But if you have a video with your voice that's 10 to 12 seconds, that will work as well. It must be under 30 megabytes. I found my recording and added it here by hitting the upload. Now you will see that it's here so we can go on to the next step. Here is where we can tell Love AI what this video is going to be about. And then our AI will help us generate a script. Or if you already have a draft, you can post it here. And if you want to connect it to one of your business profiles, you go down to business profile and you can select the business profile, but it's not necessary. I'm going to create a video about my tea company and then I'm just going to hit next. And you'll see already it's created a video title for me here. And here's the suggested script. It says, hi there, exciting news from our tea company. And look, it's taken all the information that I've provided and generated this short script. If I want AI to help me more, I can always come to this AI feature and I can make it shorter, longer. I can change the tone and I can change the language. Now, if you change the language here, it doesn't necessarily mean that the video will come out in that language, but let's say that you speak another language and you want to edit it, the script in that language. You could do that there. 
Or you could go over to the video output language, and if you want to select the final language that the video will be coming back in, this is where you're going to go down and select any different language. Then you're going to hit finish. And now you will see that there's a video holding place populated right here that says work in progress. And this is where your video will show up once it's been processed. And after a refresh, our video is populated here. And you'll see that it has the title of the video that we selected earlier on in the process. So to view this video, we're going to click on the video. And we're going to see here's our video right here. Let's take a listen. Hi there. Exciting news from our tea company. Our new holiday special is here. Enjoy a refreshing twist this winter with our green tea infused with peppermint. And then you can just pause it just like that. And you can see here's the original script. So this looks great. It's 22 seconds. And there's a few things that we can do here. The first thing that we can do is just download it. Let's say we wanted to share this on social media. Or we can do a share link. Now the great thing about this share link is this trackable link section. So what this does is if we start typing in someone's contact here... Then we can actually generate a link, and now we can copy this link right here, copy this link, and then we can go and send that link to our specific contact, and whenever they open that link, it's going to notify us here on My Momentum. But let's go back. I want to show you one more thing. I've gone back to my AI video here. And we're going to go share link again. And if let's say you don't want to send this to a specific person, we can go to public link and we can hit generate link. 